Kadena will flip Ethereum. If there is one coin that can flip Ethereum, is Kadena. Let's have a look at KDA real quick. Okay, we're gonna be diving into KDA, KDEX, Kadena Block Explorer, and so on. Twitter, some te some technical analysis on Bitcoin. See where we can go and more. So Kadena ranked 103, two dollars and 17 cents is what it's traded at down 7% almost in the past 24 hours. We have a mark cap of $400 million. Volume to mark cap ratio is 10%. Things are looking very, very good for Kadena, okay, overall. And the reason why is these news right here, okay? The Kadena ecosystem keeps on growing and it is just starting. So this is what bear markets are for. Bear markets are for building. Bear markets are opportunity. This is where you get the most opportunity in a bear market. A lot of people are saying, oh, bear market. People are coming up to me on my DMs and saying, crypto dose, why is everything pumping and Kadena's not? Why is everything exploding and Kadena's not? Why is this coin pumping and Kadena's not? Kadena has more utility. Kadena is safer. Kadena is proof of work. Um, guys, we are growing, okay? It's gonna take some time, but to you know, to to build something great, it, it needs time essentially. So right here it says KDEX. Yesterday, 24 hours ago, nothing crazy. This is not new news. We are pleased to announce KDEX is over 5.5 million total value lock TVL exactly 10 days post launch. So 10 days since the launch, guys. Kadena has already have uh, KDEX as a, or KDEX has already have 5.5 million dollars in total value lock. Don't forget to use staking multiplier for KDX token. And as you guys can see right here, KDX reward multiplier is approximately 4X. Now, this is actually very interesting. I mean, I know a lot of, uh, you know, liquidities, liquidity pools and layer twos and, and new, you know, new protocols have like uh, 100 million value locked or 200 million or sometimes even 2 billion. But guys, Kadena KDX is still new. So this is what you guys need to understand. It's very, very new. And in my opinion, it's only going to keep growing to launch this in a bear market and have a lot of success and a, a lot of hype. In my opinion, this is only going to grow from here. For those of you guys who don't know what KDEX is, end-to-end -end decentralized trading on the Kadena ecosystem. So the Kadena ecosystem keeps on growing, keeps on building. Um, and what's amazing about this is, you know, the TPS is just so high. The TPS is going to be high. It's proof of work. Um and you know there's not a lot of cryptocurrencies out there that are proof of work that can scale okay ethereum couldn't scale and it's not and it's going to proof of stake bitcoin is good as a store of value essentially um and and it only has nine transactions per second now if we go to kadena it also has 20 chains this is what it's amazing that's what's fascinating about this we have zero to 19 chains right here while bitcoin only has one kadena is literally the future it's fully decentralized right here transactions are being made uh 95 um phas right here we got okay the the total difficulty is pretty it's not so crazy 184.8 million circulating coins it is not high the max circling supply also is 1 billion so it is not high guys it is not it's really really not high in my opinion 1 billion there's a fixed supply um you know ethereum you can mint unlimited solana proof of stake avax proof of stake luna proof of stake we know what happens with proof of stake coins right now no hate to solana right I'm not saying Solana is going to go down and Solana is going to get destroyed, but I do think that Kadena could flip Solana or Ethereum in the next 10 years. Um, of course, assuming everything goes smoothly and everything. And we got also NFTs building on Kadena. So there's not going to be any, you know, the ecosystem is not going to get destroyed. They're not going to have to restart the ecosystem like uh, they do on Solana. It's not going to be high in fees like Ethereum. Um, and it's proof of work. So it's going to be safe. Now, to have proof of work and all of this happening right here, I mean, this is just fascinating. I mean, look at that. Look how it just connects. Everything is just connecting to one another. I mean, chain one, chain two, six transaction on chain two right here. Um, one transaction on chain three. Um, right? It, it's just crazy. I mean, all the blocks and everything. You know, if you guys don't know Chainweb, I mean, I'm not going to talk about Chainweb right here for the next two hours, which I really could. But if you guys don't know about Chainweb and Kadena, I would highly, highly recommend looking at Chainweb and uh, what it does and how amazing it's going to be in the future because it's going to be really crazy really really crazy and right now kadena is not at 420,000 per uh, transaction per second just yet but it will get there it will get there slowly slowly guys it's very very crazy what's about to happen we covered kdex right here we covered kadena uh let's dive into bitcoin real quick before we dive into the kadena technical analysis okay so bitcoin on the weekly time frame first of all we have three hits on the rsi which is looking very very nice okay now it's looking very nice for a beer. So the question is, is are we going to have that rejection right here coming back down and rejecting the trend line? Or are we going to go back up? 
this is something we're gonna have to really really ask ourselves in the next coming weeks because if we do end up breaking that trend line it's gonna be very very crazy and things can go fly another thing is this bearish um, bearish rising wedge that we're having right here so as you guys can see this is a rising wedge now for those of you guys who don't know rising wedges are actually bearish and it's obviously also in a bull uh, in a bear market right here so when we have rising wedge in a bear market they're most likely to break out to the downside if i pull bitcoin right here this was the falling wedge we had on a bull market so we know falling wedges because it was a uh, bullish pattern and a correction we flew to the upside and this is exactly what happened so i wouldn't be surprised if we seeing it, we're gonna see it happening again right here on kadena this is the rising wedge that we're having in a bear market and of course our target should be the bottom of the wedge right here sitting at nineteen thousand dollars but if we do break out of this rising wedge and we come to approximately twenty five and a half thousand dollars which is right here i wouldn't be surprised if bitcoin comes back and retest this level right here anywhere between thirty one thousand and twenty eight thousand dollars so that's going to be very very interesting to see what happens and if we can essentially have that nice little breakout right here happening so that's that on bitcoin if i have a look on the ema ribbons real quick we are above the exponential moving average right here on bitcoin as you guys can see for the first time we have nice multiple closure above the ema ribbon on the daily time frame so this is flipping bullish on the short time frame but if i pop the daily moving average right here or the weekly sorry we can see that this ribbon right here the bottom sits exactly at our resistance which is twenty eight thousand dollars twenty seven nine hundred so this right here is exactly what we want we're most likely going to come back up in my opinion and we have a high high chance to come back up and essentially uh come back down but we're gonna have to see how it plays out guys before anything none of this is financial advice so please always do your own research and due diligence don't listen to some random guy on youtube i mean i don't even know you guys i don't even know who's watching yeah you i don't know i don't know i don't know who you are i don't know what you're saying or or what you're thinking you could say that i'm stupid you could say that i'm smart but guys i would be careful no i'm just kidding so $28,000 is definitely a possibility. Having a look at Kadena right here real quick on the weekly time frame, we had a nice little rejection right here. It seems like it's getting ready for reversal. Um, Kadena, Kadena, Kadena. I did mention that a reversal on KDA was possible. Okay, now we still are above the trend right here on the daily time frame, at least on the four hour. I'm not so sure. Let's have a look. Now on the four hour, we are still we still are although on the four hour it's more like something like this okay so on the four hour we did break the trend on the daily we we are above it in a way so we're gonna have to see how this plays out this is the trend guys the trend is your friend until it bends as you guys know if we manage to break this we're most likely going to come back down and retest this area right here sitting at 1.5 now of course this depends on bitcoin if bitcoin decides to make moves to the top we're most likely going to see kadena move to the top but another thing that I did mention, guys, is um, the double top on Kadena right here, the bearish divergence. So, of course, this was the higher high that we had. And then on the RSI, we had a, some sort of decrease right here. Um, and, of course, we were laying flat right here on the RSI. So, this created a nice little bearish divergence. And that's about it. This is my video, guys, on Kadena, KDEX, and Bitcoin. If you guys like this video, of course, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.